It's your girl Denise, and I'm back with another viewing, fun viewing, of my series called Turning Back the Clock, Cartoons Edition. So today, guys, I'm sharing with you some more of my favorite childhood cartoons. Now, this guy, he, he had me rolling. He was so, so funny to me. I would just be like cracking up. <laughs> But um, from my research, it says that um, he was created uh, in the late 30s. Now, I kind of clocking myself, but I'm not that old. <laughs> but anyway, now this guy, he he was uh, just crazy. I mean, you know, he he had these big ears, and he's an animated character that had an opinion. <laughs> he always had something smart to say, right? But... Uh, yeah, he he's uh he was a character. So let me show you who I'm talking about. That would be this guy. Yep, Mr. Bugs Bunny. <laughs> and he loved carrots and he always uh wreaked habit with everybody, you know. Now he follows a plethora of characters, you know. It's uh a lot of characters that started on his show that went on to get their own show. And um, I'll probably share a couple of them with you guys. Um, but I always wondered about him. And I was like, well, I wonder if he have a girlfriend because he needs a girl to kind of calm him down because he's all over the place. <laughs> right? So it just so happens, though, in my research, I found out that he did. They eventually did create a girlfriend for him. And her name was Lola. So, but yeah, that was after my era. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, that Mr. Bugs Bunny was crazy old rabbit. <laughs> but anyway, let me go on to the next. <laughs> okay, guys, so now on to the next. And that would be this guy. <laughs> and yeah, like remember I was telling you how Bugs Bunny, the first one that I showed you guys, how he's always, he basically was playing tricks on people and you know, doing a lot of crazy stuff to them to make them so angry that they wanted to, of course, get rid of them. And this was one of those guys that wanted to. And as you could see, there was like signs, always signs to show that the, he's close to the rabbit. And he couldn't pronounce the word rabbit. <laughs> he would call him wabbit, like with a W. And I would crack up every single time he said that word. <laughs> but this guy was indeed a character. He had this huge rifle gun, and he would be running around trying to find this rabbit because <laughs> he wanted to have him for stew. He would always say, I'm going to have some rabbit stew. <laughs> but yeah, he, he was a, indeed a character, and he would just crack me up, you know, every time, like I said, he would say wabbit. <laughs> but yeah, that's another one of the characters that I just was crazy about. And his name was Elmer Fudd. <laughs> All right, guys. So on to the next. Okay, guys. So then last but not least, I have this little guy. <laughs> and this would be Yosemite Sam, Mr. Shoot 'em Up. <laughs> He was indeed a character and would just have me rolling because he was always with guns and always angry. <laughs> just wanted to just kill everybody. <laughs> but yeah, he was out for the rabbit too. And he would always say he hate the rabbit and he would just always be trying to uh, shoot that rabbit and the rabbit would always play tricks on him and that would make him angrier. He was already mad and just upset. So when the rabbit would play a trick on him, that would really make him upset. <laughs> he just seemed like he was angry 24-7. And for some reason, that just, just I mean, that just cracked me up. <laughs> but he always had guns. He was always wanting to kill something. But like I said, mainly uh, the rabbit. 
And then too, he was always uh, known too. I, mean, he, I guess he kind of became a legend for his quotes. Um, he would uh, he would always, like I said, say that he hated the bunny and everything. But one of his famous quotes was, "Thumbs fighting words." <laughs> I don't know why he would say that like that, but he would always say, "Thumbs fighting words," right? <laughs> but I get him because uh, that's how I feel when YouTube said you got to get four thousand views and one thousand subscribers. Them's fighting words. <laughs> But anyway, guys, um, I hope you enjoyed it. And that's my last sketch. And um, as you know, I'm presently working on some more. Uh, and um, I hope you you guys all enjoyed the, the view in the day. And uh, I hope you come back, you know. And if I have any new people, thank you guys so much for making the choice to uh, jump on board and be, you know, included in my ride at eyes. <laughs> And uh, I hope you have a blessed week. And um, I hope I see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Oh, and by the way, guys, if you have a favorite cartoon when you was a kid, feel free to drop it in the comment box. I love to hear what you what uh, what your favorite was. All right then, see you next time.